Let's look outside at how amazing our weather can be. We are seeing a cold front moving through the coastal bin right now, so you can see showers developing along this front. We have foggy conditions along our coast, so that's what we're seeing in Corpus Christi right now is some fog, but otherwise the rain is coming. Now it's not a lot of rain, but there are some pockets of heavier rain embedded within this line of showers that's developed along the cold front, which is now approaching Beeville, Mathis, moving through Orange Grove. Alice, you're right at the front. The rain is getting to you here shortly. Falfuria, similar story. So as this front moves through, temperatures will be dropping. Check this out. George West, over the last 15 minutes, has fallen from 64 to 58. So we have seen a drop of 6 degrees in 15 minutes there in George West. Hebronville sitting at 54. But ahead of the front, we're still at 70, so big changes are on the way as you if you're headed out the door right now, you're going to think, wow, it, it's a nice, warm, muggy kind of day in the coastal bin. But by this afternoon, we'll be closer to George West. So we'll see 50s this afternoon, so be prepared for the changing weather. Have a rain jacket or an umbrella as you head out the door as well, because we will be tracking some rain through the morning. But then this afternoon, temperatures are going to stay on the cooler side. You'll want a jacket uh, to keep you on the warm side. We'll be in the 50s this afternoon. Additionally, we are going to have a strong northwest wind with some gusts around 30 miles per hour. That will create a bit of a wind chill, so it's going to feel gloomy out there today and cool by this afternoon. Tomorrow morning we kick things off in the 40s. So that is nearly a 70 degree difference. Excuse me from 70 to 46 is nearly a 30 degree difference. We will be uh, I guess a 24 degree difference, but nonetheless still a big change tomorrow morning compared to this morning. Lows across the region tonight 41 in George West 43 in Sinton, 43 in Rockport 43 in Kingsville as you're headed out the door and it's getting colder. We've got another cold front on the way Friday. That will bring in cool, dry air to the region on Saturday, and that's when we have a chance for some freezing temperatures. That's what we'll have to keep an eye out, out on. 34 in Corpus Christi areas inland, such as Beeville, George West, you have a chance of, of hitting the freezing mark. So keep that in mind. That's Saturday morning. Then temperatures warm back up Sunday and Monday. So what we are tracking today is cold front number one. Cold front number one moves through this morning along the coast about 10 a.m. We'll have the heavier rain and thunderstorms to our north through central Texas and then offshore we get some thunderstorm activity, but that will be well offshore and nothing to worry about right along our coastline here. Winds are offshore, so we'll get northwest winds later on today. Still fairly breezy 18 miles per hour at 530 as the sun's beginning to set. Then cold front number two approaches, but first we see high pressure in between the two fronts, making for a magnificent Thursday. I plan to be outdoors all day Thursday. Don't worry about that, okay? But then cold front number two moves through and we are going to see that cooler and drier air settling in over the weekend as well. So temperatures are going to be much cooler for Friday and Saturday with highs in the 60s and that low of 34 Saturday morning. But then notice we do have a warming trend and potentially cold front number three headed our way Monday night into Tuesday. Right now it doesn't look like that's going to impact temperatures a lot, but there is a chance of rain with that front Barbie.